G'day, you rotten lot. Welcome back to the channel. Thank you very much for tuning in today. We have from Laney or Black Country Customs, the Steel Park Boost. Now, this is not just a boost. It gives you up to 30 dB. Uh, it also has a separate base and treble boost as well if you want. It has a dirt knob, which is awesome. So you can add some extra overdrive and grit to your signal. And it has this little three-way toggle switch here, which also has a changing uh, color LED light, a multicolor LED light, which gives you an upper mids boost, a flat boost, and a lower mids boost, which gives you lots and lots of boosting dirt goodness. Now today for something completely different, I'm going into this vintage 1966 Maton all valve, single amp, non-master uh, valve amp. It is a beast, it is, well, 1966, what's that? I mean, it's well over 50 years old and it's still going strong. It's amazing. It's had a couple of things recapped and stuff, uh, but it's still the original valves, believe it or not. And I've got it pushed to the point where it's very loud in here, but it's also uh, just starting to break up. It can be nice and quiet if you want. Nice and clean, nice and clean if you want. Just starting to break up, and he's very loud. I've got it running into one of the green cabs that way. Green cabs behind me. Marshall 12s with a, uh, it's got a cream back in it, Celestine cream back. Now I think I've got it set up towards pretty much unity, which is awesome. I can feel a little extra fullness in there with the circuitry uh, from the pedal. I feel a little bit of extra oomph in it, which is good. I've got the switch in the middle position, which is just a flat boost across the whole frequency spectrum. I've got both the middle and treble knobs set right in the middle. Now there is a little clicky indentation right in the middle so you can feel exactly where the middle is. So you can actively add bass and treble or you can actively take bass and treble away. At the moment, they're both right in the middle where the little clicky stop is. And the extra dirt is on zero. So what I'm gonna do is go through all the different modes. So first, this is the flat full frequency boost. So that's with the boost up full. I know it's hard to see, I know it's hard to see on these silver shiny knobs where the arrow is, but that boost there, that is up full now. I'm gonna turn up the bass and the treble knobs now. Just gonna leave them a little bit past the middle 12 o'clock uh, clicky position bit. Now I'm gonna take everything out. Bring everything back up to the 12 o'clock position. Now I've still got the boost volume on fully. So it's already boosting it considerably. Now I'm gonna add in the dirt. I can tell the amp's working really hard behind me now. 
That's with the dirt and the boost all the way up with the treble and middle both on 12 o'clock. <laughs> That's back to the dirt off. Now I'm going to flick it up into the upper mid position. Make sure both these are still at 12 o'clock. Here's my amp. So it's already generating a different kind of boost. This is the upper mid boost. It's creating more distortion inside the valves in the amp. Brought the dirt all the way in now. Bring it back about halfway. Now I've got the treble knob up. Treble back at 12 and the bass all the way up. Now this is bass and treble all the way up, volume all the way up or boost all the way up. Just double check that, yep, and dirt all the way off. Tell you what, these old valve amps, they really love a boost pedal, don't they? It's amazing. Now, I'm going to flick it down from upper mid boost to lower mid boost. All right, I've got the uh, bass and the treble back down to 12 o'clock. The dirt, oh, back into the middle position, I've got the dirt all the way off. Treble all the way up. Oh, bass all the way up. There's a lot of bass in here now. Right now, while I'm in the lower mid position, I've got these both back at 12 o'clock. I've got the boost volume up full. I'm going to wind in some dirt now. That is the Black Country Customs Steel Park. They're part of the Laney group. We'd like to thank Laney very, very much for sending this out to us. Do have a play around with. If you do have an old valve amp or a new valve amp or any kind of valve amp for that matter that you would like to really push the front of, uh, this is the pedal for you. It has separate bass and treble controls which you can actually actively add to or actively take away. It's got 30 dB of... Um, Boost, and then it also has an extra dirt or overdrive circuit in there as well, which you can wind in separately. 
The toggle switch gives you upper mids flat response or lower mid boost. I think it's an absolute beauty. Plus it looks a treat. Just have a look at it. It's shiny, it's lovely. And I really like the fact that the, uh, the LED uh, changes colors when you're in different modes because those uh, multicolor LEDs are not cheap. So that's a really nice uh, little addition. The switch is really good. The build quality is excellent. Everything you would expect from, you know, a Black Country Customs product. Thank you very much for tuning in. If you've got this far, please give us a thumbs up, a like, a subscribe, leave a comment, something like that. It all helps the channel out uh, a lot and helps us bring you more content about cool pedals like this. Thank you for tuning in. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.